I'm Stephen Doherty, reporting about the new renovations happening at Arnett Hall. There, the Zusai program at West Liberty University is making changes to benefit the animals there. We believe that this will not only benefit the animals, but the students as well, bringing a better quality of life to students in their learning and for the animals. Here, we are going to interview people on what they think of the renovations and if they are worth it or not. In our net hall, I got an interview with a sophomore zoo science major to see how involved the students are in the program and their thoughts on the renovations coming to the new building. Hi, I'm here with Taylor Hartman, a student from the zoo sci program. I'm here to ask her about the new renovations that are happening in our net hall. Taylor, can you tell us what is happening with uh, the renovations? Do you know about them? Uh, in the future, we're going to turn one of the math rooms down the hall on the third floor into more enclosures for animals. Ah, and do you think this will benefit the campus or the program in any form or way? Yeah, it will make the enclosures larger for some of the pre-existing animals, which will improve their quality, and then it will also allow us to include more variety, which should include a wider variety of people, too. Oh, that's great. That's interesting. And that will bring more success to the school and the programs, which will be great for our campus. After interviewing Taylor, I met up with a non-zoo science major to see if students in other majors had anything to say or if they knew about the renovations in our net. A broadcast major, Gavin Banky, agreed to an interview and shared his opinions with us. Hi, I'm here with Gavin Banky. Gavin, do you know about the renovations happening in our net hall? No. Well, the zoo side program is running uh, renovations for the animals for the program to improve. What's your opinion on this? Um, I guess the more room for the animals, the better, because I love animals. Great. Do you think it'll be help? Do you think it will help the students? Well, do you think it will help the students? I mean, if they get more animals, like they can learn off the different animals. So yeah, it'd be beneficial. Great. Thank you for your time, Gavin. After talking with Gavin, I went back to our net to get proper verification and details of what renovations are happening. I got a hold of an expert, Sarah Johansson, a graduate student who has been actively assisting in the making and planning of new enclosures. Hello, I'm here with Sarah Johansson. Sarah, could you tell us how will these renovations help the program? The renovations will help the program in a variety of ways because not only are the students getting hands-on experience caring for the animals and learning what their environment should look like, uh, but it's also going to be better welfare or a better living environment for the animals to be in more naturalistic enclosures, being able to do things that they naturally do in the wild. Uh, so we're really looking forward to the renovations from both a student and animal perspective. That's amazing. and that's So what have the students learned or gotten from this? Or have they helped at, have they helped at all? Yeah, absolutely. So the students are actually helping to do some of the renovations. So the current renovations we have going on uh, with Norbert, one of our larger animals, and then with Steve, our Aki monitor. Uh, Steve and Terry's exhibit is actually being redone by myself as a graduate student and also as a zookeeper. Um, uh, but all our undergraduate students in the zoo herpetology class, they had to build a vivarium as a part of that class experience. So some of them redid Mort's enclosure, which is our Argentinian black and white tegu, and some of them built a brand new enclosure for our spiny-tailed iguanas. So students have been very much a part of this process as well. Wow, well, thank you. The zoo science program, only being three years old, has made great strides and with the upcoming renovations making way for our new enclosures, we hope to continue seeing it improve, expand, and impress us. Well, that's all for now. I'm Stephen Doherty, reporting on the changes in Arnett Hall.